Hello everybody, I'm James. This is my Persia campaign. I'm gonna move this troop over here. Combine them. Because they should be able to still walk until I captured this province, so I want to make sure I get that. So that will cut them off. Rebels broke. Sarbadar. Still allied, though. Alright, we're going to declare for this province. Take that troop from the lesser nobles, I will offer favors to the other nobles. I'll take partial from the greater nobles. We can stack wipe them. I didn't actually anticipate getting on here. I didn't think they'd move their men. You go there. You two go there. They're not building troops, so they're building them over here. It's a fort level three. If I can take this province now, that actually would probably be in my best interest. Sufi Rebot. Sufi mystics were naturally attracted to the frontiers of Islam, where they set up hostels and forts known as ribats. Ribbits. So we could allow it. It gives local trade power plus 0.1 local tax modifier, negative 10% local manpower modifier, or demand they dismantle it. Sir John, Sir John being here. I like the base trade power. That's fine. I can stay. This respite has two troops. So that's a third of the troops that I would need to take that. Yeah, I definitely want to take that province if possible. So Herat is in this war, and Banu Yas. Let's get everybody on this province. I 
like to piece out these guys without actually fighting them. I'd only be able to land 3,000 troops. I know Mozgan has troops over there. They also have 2,000. They have 3,000 troops, so they could attack me as I try to land. So I'd prefer not to try that. I think I'll commit to the siege. I'm gonna try to roll a general. Hopefully, maybe get two siege pips. Yeah, we did get two siege pips. We got three, four, two, two. He is markedly better than the other guy. So let's get rid of that guy. That should make that siege go a little bit quicker. Take that troop off. So Herat hasn't come down here because they can't get access. So as long as they can't get access, that's good. just be up there doing their own thing That, that, and that. I think taking it should be enough to get them to peace out. At least by the time we actually do take it. We'll pick up a bunch of war score from holding this. those guys state supports and it was a lot of troops You get a little bit of manpower from the lesser nobles. Prefer to take from the greater nobles. Still would not, mostly because of the ongoing battles. Hopefully we can win this. Destroy their navy. Yep, they would actually accept that. 
They would even give me Bayron. You know what? I'll go ahead and just take that. If I can't hold it, I'll just sell it back to them. Uh, I'll just take 10 ducats. That's good. As Raspid doesn't like us, just go ahead and stop the trade. Widespread condemnation will hurt our relations with other Muslim countries by negative 35. Or you let our military advisor go. Go ahead and just lose 25. Rehire this guy. That's, uh, that guy's pretty good. Stability increase interval, negative 10%. Let's All right, we took uh, four provinces from them. This province, uh, we can assign it to a trade company. It's kind of funny to me to assign a province so close to a trade company. Not sure if I should actually do that. That would help with unrest. I think I can always remove it in the future. I think I'm going to do that. I'm going to assign this to a trade company. It disables automatic spread of institutions in that province. Gives local unrest negative 10, local trade power, local missionary strength negative 4%. Minimum local autonomy. If this province becomes sufficiently well built and I build ports over here and over here to get to it, then I'll remove it. But I think for now, since it's different culture, religion, there's no ports, there's no port connection coming to or going from that province. I'll go ahead and just do that. And delete this Merc unit. Should increase my trade income from this uh, node, because that is four provinces. I think I'll have to delete a couple of these galleys. I can't sell them, which I don't imagine I can. I don't think anybody's going to buy any of these ships. I'll try to sell whatever I can. We have no sailors and very low manpower. Put those guys back on drilling for now. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna drill these two units. So this unit doesn't have anything, and then I'll just reduce army maintenance.
start coring that stuff. These two are actually pretty good provinces, because this has indigo. And this one obviously has the trade modifier, and it also has coffee. So I think I'll build in this one. That'll probably be my uh, province that I build in for this region. Mostly because it's what I have right now. So that's where I'll put extra ducats. And uh, that'll be it for this episode. So I'm going to end this part here and pick up the next part. Thanks for watching, and goodbye.